Well guys, I made it to the mall this weekend, but I didn't come here to ice skate. I actually came here because there's a new store that I want to check out if I can find it. But I actually think it's by the ice skating rink, so I came in the right entrance. This is the store I wanted to check out. Perfect Whip. I think I've tried the Beauty Foam before. It's pretty good. Mild cleanser. I believe they're scented. I can't remember. This is one of my favorite. I haven't used it in a while. Oh no, this is by Sauna. I'm sorry. It looked like the Hadalabo one, but Sauna is a good brand. They have um, this really hydrating milky toner that I really like. Biore has some facial cleansers here, $13.99. They are scented, but probably pretty mild. Look at all of the beauty products, you guys. So I've used this Naturi Hadamuji Skin Conditioning Gel. It's pretty good, I recommend it. They also have a toner, more lightweight and consistency compared to this. What is this? Hair Treatment Mask by Crazy. I've tried some Crazy shampoos before. They're really good. Leave the hair nice and manageable. They have a nice scent too. Um, latte conditioner. I might have to try that by Crazy. And they have a damage repair shampoo. Surely this is like the most popular section of this store, I would imagine. What's Angel Skin from Nivea? Is that a body wash? Yeah, it's a body body wash. And they have a ton of face masks. Haven't tried any of these. I have tried the Lululun face masks. They're pretty good. Nice and hydrating. It's been a long time though since I've used them. Several years. And what's this? I'm always attracted to package brightener light color lotion. This is a SPF 15. This is kind of like a, I wonder if this is like a tone up milky sunscreen. What's this? Hair acne. They don't have the ingredients on that one in English. Ooh, Softimo has a cleansing foam with hyaluronic acid. Their cleansing oil is really good. Oh, this is a really good sunscreen. I wonder how they're able to sell it here. It's interesting. Usually, yeah, because it's got ingredients not approved for use in sunscreens in the US. That's interesting. I've never, I don't know that I've ever seen it sold on the shelves here. I mentioned sauna before. I really like this Q10 lotion. It's quite good. I haven't used this. Q10 is an antioxidant though that um, can help boost your skin's own antioxidant supply. I love this body wash from Curel. Highly recommend it. The Intensive Moisture Care. It's really good. This urea hand cream is really good. I've gotten it from Stylevana before. Didn't realize they had what looks like a foot cream and a body milk, tiny little bottle. Check out all the sunscreen they have here. I'm just now seeing this. Ooh, UV milk. Look at all of these tone up sunscreens from Suncut. This is really good. I've tried it before. I like the Biore UV Kids a lot too. The Alley sunscreens are really good. $31.99. I need to try 
try a Japanese toothpaste, active berry mint, although I try and avoid the mint. These look like they all have mint. What are these eggs? Water glycerin, super stretch sensations for men. What is, maybe it's like a portable, okay, I'm, I'm not sure what that is. Maybe it's not, maybe it's not suitable for YouTube for us to do, delve further into what that might be. These, are these shampoos? They look interesting. Oh, mouthwash. Okay. I'm surprised to see detergent in the new scents mouth. <laughs> That's cute. Translation. Cherry blossom mouthwash. Interesting. I kind of want to try one. It's also most suitable for a smoker and oral hygiene. I don't need, but I love Pachaco. And cinnamon roll. Oh, sweet. Oh my goodness, look at all of the pens. When I was a child, I would have gone berserk over this. I was really into all things Hello Kitty. I still do enjoy. And they have all kinds of candies. Milky. She's cute. She kind of looks like little Audrey. Let me know if you guys know who little Audrey is. Little Audrey and little Lulu. Those look fun. Is this popcorn and candy corn? Looks like it. Interesting. Okay, this is not big enough for my needs, but it's sweet nonetheless, and it has a little strap. This little Karomi character. It's cute. Oh, look at the cinnamon roll one. It's got a little handle. More dishes. These are like strawberry. type set where you have your own little wax seal. How sweet is that? It comes with a little wax you melt in this little spoon. And there's a there's a little stamp. It's cinnamon roll. And then you have a little candle to heat it up. What is this? My Melody. Is this a coloring book? Just blank paper? Yeah kinds of little notebooks. I was just shopping for little notebooks. I should have waited till coming here. This one's got grass, graph paper. I almost said grass paper, graph paper. Washi tape. Neiman Marcus and this Augustinus Bader. Um, obviously expensive, not necessary, but look how cute these eye gel compact thingies are. I have no idea what's in those, but I don't want to hover too much because 
they may think I'm interested in buying it. Oh, they have Brody Owl. This skin tint is actually really good. Um, as like, it, it provides a modest amount of cosmetic camouflage. So it's a little bit denser in comparison to just like a tinted sunscreen. I wanna say, I can't remember you guys. I think it's a, I don't know if these are glued down. Oh, they're not, cool. I don't remember what kind of sunscreen it is, like if it's organic or, or not. I just remember I really liked it. Bee venom, adios. <laughs> Hotel lobby scented candle. Look how pretty this Easter setup is. Candles. Ooh, how pretty is that? It's pretty, it's gone. Dogwoods. I was sitting here trying to think what those flowers are called. Oh my goodness, you guys, a champagne vending machine. <laughs> that idea why not hey it's my theragun i have this mine's in black and i swear by it i use it every single day um it's really good for getting the knots out of your upper back oh dear ready for my close-up what do they have over here oh molten brown these are always in like hotels and stuff but do people actually buy this stuff it's always like in fancy hotels. Hey, virtue. Is this hair care? Looks like it. Then what do we have back here? Stream caviar. We already know that's pricey. Anything caviar. And we've got all of the New Face gadgets. So I tried New Face a while ago, reviewed it. Um, it gave a temporary kind of tightening effect that was not long lasting throughout the day. Um, but it's good in, the co in a cosmetic sense. Like I do feel like it's nice to do before you put your makeup on, kind of cut down on puffiness. But these are the hair turbans I use, the Aquas ones. The flip doesn't have a little button on it, if I'm remembering correctly, like the turban does. Man, what is it? Whether it's Walmart or Neiman Marcus, you cannot escape the crying child. <laughs> or a bay. I really like this Gold Boss Nourishing Hair Oil, but I wasn't too impressed with their shampoo. That being said, I only tried like a sample of it but I do like the, the hair oil quite a bit. But honestly, I think while I love it a lot, I'm always on the hunt for something similar at a drugstore price because it is expensive. But I've had the same little mini bottle for a couple of years now and I don't use very much of it, but I'm, I'm kind of stingy with it. Fiber Groom Elastic Texture Paste. That seems like something that if it's good, would be worth investing in because hair care styling products, I don't use styling products, but when I have, it, it's definitely trial and error. You don't necessarily need an expensive product, but something like that, it really has to, it really has to be just right. Ooh, I do love a good moisturizing mask, but I'm gonna stick with drugstore for that. Someday, if I'm feeling spendy or somebody is feeling generous and gifts me an Orbe shampoo, I would like to try another scent besides the Gold Lust fragrance, but I don't know. The Serene Scalp looks interesting. I'm guessing it's lavender scented. Silverati shampoo. but when I do, I like to come in here and just look around. How pretty is this dress? I love that for 
spring. Look at these cute shoes. like it would be complicated to launder. I like these little suits. This one in the gold. It's really pretty. I like this cute little sweater too. of Dolce & Gabbana created this for Texas, the Yellow Rose collection. <laughs> it's pretty, a pretty pattern. It's another sweet little pink sweater. It's kind of flashy. Suncut UV Mild Care Milky Gel SPF 50 Sunscreen from Kose. I look forward to trying it out. Look how nice the little shopping bags are. Totally reusable. Love it. Yeah, I'm really glad I had the opportunity to go and check that shop out. I heard we got one and I was like, I'm gonna run over there and see what it's like. It's good to see that the mall is thriving and jiving. I never really thought I would say that, but at the same time, I know that malls are a dying species, which I, I feel a little torn on, even though I've always kind of been an anti-mall person. What, you always want what, what you can't have or you think is begun, gonna become rare. So there were a lot of people there having a good time and I'm glad I got to check out that new shop and peruse Neiman Marcus. Hopefully you all enjoyed it as well. If so, give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends and as always, don't forget, sunscreen and subscribe. I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Bye. Mm -hmm.